Hello everybody, today I will be giving you guys my top 5 favorite Mac features. So number 1 on the list we have the all new photo editing feature, brand new in macOS High Sierra. So to access it all you have to do is open up a photo that you have on your laptop or desktop and head over to the top right where it says edit photo. You're going to click on that and it now gives all these different options that you can change to um, to update your photo, right? So you could change the brilliance, exposure, the light, the color, you can make it black and white, you can change the curves. I'm not very good with uh, photo editing, but in this new uh, software that is provided to you directly on the laptop, you have all these super cool features that make photo editing, editing surprisingly easy. So number two on our list, we have emojis. And yes, it is actually surprisingly difficult to access emojis on a MacBook unless you have the touch bar. But if you don't have the touch bar, which many people do not, all you have to do is hit command, control, space, which will then open up this menu here where you can choose through all the emojis that Apple has to offer. There are just so many emojis. So we'll just take this bowling pins one right here click on it and right there it is in our page or message or you can do this anywhere that you can type so next up we have cellular hotspots all you have to do is head to settings personal hotspot and turn on personal hotspot assuming you have cellular turned on and then on your Mac all you have to do is head up to the Wi-Fi button right here click on it hit iPhone and put in your custom password that will be displayed on your iPhone. Once you've done that, you have a cellular connection from iPhone to Mac. So fourth on our list we have tagging files. To do this all you have to do is open a file, click up here on the arrow, and go to tags. Click right there and you'll have all these options. Here you can choose a color that you want to tag the file under. So let's just say we tag it under the red color. Then if we go into the folder here where it says red, you'll find that file. You can do this with all the different colors for tags and you can do this to any file. This can be especially helpful when trying to organize a certain group of files into a specific area. So say you have a YouTube channel and you want to organize your clips into one area, you can do this easily with the color tagging feature. And the final feature on our list is a cool one. It is 3D city tours on Apple Maps. So all you have to do is find a city uh, for this example, we're going to use Pittsburgh, and you can just hit on that 3D sign right there, and it's gone now, <laughs> but there it is now. You just hit on it and press tour, and then it will actually give you a satellite tour of the city. So this would be really cool if you were planning a vacation, and you want to see what the town is like before you go there, just to see what you're in for before you go. So right here... We are getting our tour of Pittsburgh, and as you can see, the tour goes to major monuments in the cities, not just regular trees and stuff, which is super cool, and it uses artificial intelligence to create this pretty cool tour. So with that, I'm Vortex City. I hope you guys enjoyed these five cool features on your new Mac. Subscribe to this channel to see more tech videos just like the one you're watching right now, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day.